Hello everyone and welcome to Jojo's Break Time. This is the Lego Creator 3 in 1 toy shop that came out in 2020 and you can convert it into a cafe or a flower shop. But today I am doing something else for mine. This is what the Creator Toy Shop looks like when it's built, except I have taken everything out from inside of it, all the furniture and fittings, because I will be fitting it out with something else. I decided to keep the building the same as I liked the look of it, but I'll just be adding a few extra bits and pieces to make it fit in my city. Hello! I will be standing out the front at the moment and putting some accessories at the front of the shop. Here's a lovely planter pot with some beautiful orange flowers. I have put a camera on this fancy sign to put above the door of the shop so you know that this will be a photography studio. On this side I've put a brick with a Technic pin in there so I can put up another sign and this one is of a family portrait. There we are. Oh and look I've done a camera on a tripod and we're going to pop that at the front of the shop so you definitely know what this shop is about. I'll be fitting out the shop floor first. I'm using Emma's Photo Studio that came out in 2017 as it fits quite nicely in my little shop. It's got little lights already there and a nice background backdrop. Whoopsies, this disc has stuck to my finger. Let's pop it back in. There we are. Now we will be fitting out with some accessories so you can dress up for your photo shoot. Now I'll be putting a printer in into the shop, there it is, as I want everyone to take their photos home as soon as they're done. Here's a camera with a nice big lens and zoom on it to take some beautiful professional photos with. Have some tiles with some pictures on them already, so they're all of the Lego friends. If you have minifig photos, you can pop them in if you like. I'll be popping these in the shop front windows. And I'll get, oh dear, fell out of my hand. Let's try this again. Everyone, when everyone will walk past, they'll see the beautiful photos. And we have here oh, two of Emma. And we have Andrea and her bird, and we have Olivia with Zobo, her robot. We'll pop that in the printer, because it will be printing out now. And this is Joan. She is the photographer in this photo studio. And she loves taking pictures of everyone. So I'm popping on the first floor now of the apartment and this is where Joan lives also so she doesn't have to go far to work. It's not a very roomy apartment but we'll pop in as much as we can and my daughter has actually made all this for me for this apartment. We have a little fridge with a milk in it and some yummy popcorn. And now we need the kitchen sink and it has a little dishwashing detergent on there as well and a little fork in the sink already. And we have a vase. Got to brighten up this little apartment with some flowers. There we are. And an oven and something's baking inside. Oh yummy, I wonder what she is baking. I hope Joan hasn't forgotten about the oven being on. And look at this couch. This yellow colour is lovely and it fits perfectly here. We have a little entertainment cabinet with some more flowers and a mobile phone and a fancy lamp. Look at that, fits out this apartment nicely. 
This is the third floor of the apartment and I have made it the same as the original. I love the architecture in this and here where the door was I have put a long window in as I didn't have those little new window pieces yet. Let's pop some furniture in. And here's the bed. This came with the apartment. Thought we'll reuse it as it's a really nice bed. Uh, some more flowers as Joan really likes brightening up her apartment with flowers. Now we need a little bedside table with a lamp and we've made this pink because it's for friends but you can change the colour if you like, if it's for minifigs. And now a bookshelf with all important books for reading and another plant with a vase. <laughs> And we have a beautiful green rug to finish off this room. And a cat. She has a pet cat. Snowy, I think it is. Yes, let's name it Snowy. Let's top off this building with the roof part that came with the original. Look at that. Look how nice it looks as a three story have to step aside I have forgotten we need more plants here pop that in at the front and one more pot plant up on the balcony I'm gonna make it look pretty and green and colorful I like the look of this building it is going to fit perfectly into my city Oh, we have a mum and baby coming. They're going to get their photo taken. A baby with a bottle. Here comes dad and mum's fallen over when she found out the price of the family package. Don't worry mum, the photo will be worth it. You'll love it. Oh, and here's Mia. She's had her photo taken with her puppy. Look at that. They're all happy. Joan's taking a photo of the baby outside with a cute bottle and I thought I want to jump in the picture too as the baby's so cute. For my city I felt this building had to be three stories high. I love the architecture of it and I feel that having the third floor really finishes this building off. And I wanted to fit it out with a friends theme as most of my city is friends. I hope I've given you some ideas of what you can create with yours. So everyone, get your bricks out, get building and get creative. See you for the next video.